Pine Pine 137 wakes up and soars through the sunny skies for a new day of fun. This was a routine route that had been flown several times before, but nevertheless, Plane Plane was still very excited. From its starting location, Plane Plane was headed northeast to a spot just south of a large lake where there were lots of trees and some ducks. Along the way would be the small town of Bucket, Ohio, a somewhat difficult route as there are many distractions along the way. Plane Plane's primary objective hunting the ever-elusive mode. When plane planes fly, it's common for them to release chemtrails into the air. Real trails from planes are harmless, as they're just water vapor. But since plane plane is a bug, the chemtrails actually have an effect. These chemtrails draw mollies to the surface so they can be hunted. This man calls himself Critter Tracker, a self-proclaimed plane plane expert. He sent us this footage unprompted. Plane planes usually have a few maneuvers they like to pull off in the air. They think it's fun to do these moves. Depending on the temperature and climate, plane planes will reach anywhere from 7 to 10,000 feet. And once at that altitude, they can do all sorts of crazy and wacky things. Before the time of the incident, it was recorded that 137 did a whole bunch of loop-de-loops in the air. These funny maneuvers were verified by several residents of Bucket. What they saw that day was anything but funny. To them, it seemed as if a plane-like object was flying far too low and dangerously close to the ground. Many citizens called emergency services, hoping that someone would stop this plane from swerving around in the sky all crazy-like. They looked on in horror as this plane would swoop very close to the ground and in their faces and all around and up and about the clouds and the buildings. This went on for several hours, and many felt hopeless as they could not stop this phenomenon from happening. Plane Plane could not be stopped. Good evening, this is your nightly news at 10. I'm Eric Nightmare. The annual smelt festival is in jeopardy, as vendors discovered today they had been sent anchovies and sardines instead. This leaves only one week for event organizers to acquire the correct type of fish. Our top story, however? A plane has been spotted flying very close to buildings and very low in the sky. However, experts say it's a bug, an insect, and not a vehicle. But I don't buy that. I'm stupid, and I have a mistrust of intelligence. Is that plane? Oh, it's flying real low. Oh, oh, it's flying too low. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, 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 oh, my, oh, my life is over. Ah! Thank <laughs> you.